thank you for joining my tutorials today we learn how we can able to prepare lineament density map from this bowen lineaments so how we can able to take this lineaments in arcgis and also we are able to digitize this and after that we will prepare our lineament density map so how we can able to take this for that what we need to do we need to go to google and search here as a bowen nrsc after searching this Bhuvan NRSC, we will click on the Bhuvan NRSC. After that, when we'll, uh, after clicking here, we will come to the portal of a Bhuvan. And from here, we need to go to thematic services. After thematic services, there are different kinds of maps are there. There's a land use, then uh, land degradation. So we want lineaments. So here is the lineaments. So just click on the lineaments for which state we want it. So suppose I want for the Maharashtra, I'll select here Maharashtra. And after that, if you want any particular place like Aurangabad, anything, then you can click there and just click on the view option. So you can able to see the lineaments here. Okay. So now I'm interested to uh, take this lineaments into our ArcGIS environment. So for that, in the web services, there is a link is given here. Okay. So the web map services, WMS layer. So this layer we need to copy from here. Don't take this inverted commas from here. Just copy this link. After that, we need to go to ArcGIS. Just go to, here is the option that is a GI services. Just click on GI services. Then add WMS services. And after that, we need to paste the link here just click on the gate layers as we'll click on the gate layers getting information from the wms servers it will take little bit time and now we can able to see this geo servers web map services added here and just we'll click on the okay so after clicking on the okay we'll go to this here you can able to see this geo server geo server web map is added here just click here and again click here again click here these are the files and we want lineament file so the lineament file number we'll see here that is a lineament image ln 50k and 0506 this file we want so we'll search this the lineament file so we'll go to the uh, here first is a lineament image so image ln we need to find so image, we'll go to the image. So here is the M. After going to M, we need to find this sequence. We need to find image. Image after that LN. So this image LN and this is for the LULC. Then image LN 50. K0506. So we just need to drag here. So this lineament we have added here. And now we need to digitize the lineament. Okay. How we can able to digitize and after digitize, we can able to prepare the lineament density map. So suppose I will add one uh, shape file here. Okay. So let I will go to shape file portion. So to add a shape file, I will take any shape file here. So suppose this is the shape file. Okay, just I will hollow this. So what are the lineaments are coming here that I'm interested to digitize and from that I will prepare the lineament density map. Okay, so how we can able to digitize this lineament? To digitize this lineament, just create a shape file here. So to create a shape file, first we need to refresh this folder. After that, I will right click new shape file. So just provide a polyline here. Go to edit. Then we need to, this file is WGS, uh, this file is in 
decimal degree. So we'll select a WS 94. Okay. And okay. So now my shape file is created. Just right click. Go to editors. Start editing. So after start editing, we can able to digitize these lineaments. So my editor is start. So just take this new shape file and digitize this lineament. Like this, we need to digitize all the lineaments. Whatever the lineaments are available here, that one by one we need to digitize. So this way you can digitize the lineament. So just like that, you need to digitize all your lineaments, what are the lineaments available in the this file. So after digitizing all the lineaments, what we need to do, we need to just click on save edit and stop edit. So just click on this save edit and stop edit. So this way you can able to see what are the lineaments are there that you have digitized in the area. So now what we need to do, we need to project this file first okay so how we can able to project this to project this we need to go our toolbox so we'll go to the art toolbox in the arc toolbox there is a data management tool in the data management tool there is a projection and transformation and project is there so we'll project both the files so just take this new shape file that is our lineament file. So here we need to provide folder where we want to save this data. So I will just save this data in the my D drive. So PR chip project elements. Just provide the UTM zone. At what UTM zone it will come. So you can check my previous videos. In that I have shown how to you can able to find exact UTM zone. So this is fall in 43 UTM zone, Aurangabad. So I'll take the 43 UTM zone and just click on OK. So this way we can able to project both the files. And after that, we'll prepare the lineament density map. So project is successfully. After that, I will project this file. So my study area, same file I will keep. That is a PRJ projected study area. Here also I will provide a 43 UTM zone. Just click on OK. So both the file are projected. Now we can able to see here. So both the file are projected. So I'll take this new one. And I will add this projected study area. And this is my lineament. 
so now from this i want to create now this is in meter you can able to see in the properties also we can able to check so this is in utm zone 43 so now we'll go to the r toolbox to create a lineament density map just go to r toolbox in the arc toolbox there is a special analysis tool in the special analysis tool there is a density in the density there is a line density so to create a lineament density input polyline features so this is my input polyline feature that is our lineament after that just give the output location where we want to save so we'll save here lineament Lineament density. So it will take, it will give lineament density. It is a large name, so we'll give small name linear density. After that, here in what unit we want. So we want in square kilometer, we have selected the square kilometer. If you want to change unit, we can change after that we need to go to environment because we need to give extent for this shape file so just go to environment in the environment output coordinate here we'll select as a same layer as our study area again we need to go to the processing extent so select as a projected study area again we need to go below and the raster analysis we need to clip this we need to mask this so for the mask we'll select this area as a study area and just click on ok and just click on ok so this way we can able to prepare a lineament density map so here now you can able to see i will take this up so this is my lineament density map just right click go to properties symbology here we can classify into five classes you select your color ramp so this area is having a very highest lineament density because this area is having a highest uh, lineaments so this is showing the highest lineament density here we are not getting any lineaments so this area is having a very low uh, lineament density like this we can able to download the lineaments uh, we can digitize the lineaments from the Bu, whatever data we are getting from the uh, Bhuvan and from easily we can able to prepare the lineament density map. So it is very easy. So hope you will get it. If you have any problem, you can contact us. Thank you.